So we're at Pilchard Press Cottage, which is a two bedroom cottage, ground floor cottage effectively within Back Road West in St Ives. It's all of this ground floor here and includes this garage to the rear. I'll take you inside and show you the property in a minute and you'll see how that garage works, but effectively it's all of this, all of this ground floor area. Great location, obviously. That's Porthmere Road down there, which takes you down to Porthmere Beach, just literally just a couple of minutes walk away. And then there's Island Road down there, which takes you again to that end of Portland Beach and onto the island. It's set right in the, the centre of St Ives. There's Fish Street and the famous Mermaid Restaurant. So you're right in the centre of the town here, close to everything. I'll take you inside the cottage now. So we're now inside the cottage. Um, you've got a lovely stable door here to the front and to Barrow West. And this is the main living room. We've got an ash floor. There's a radiator in here. There's gas central heating throughout each, each room, but it's fantastic, lovely, big living room. We've got a handcrafted kitchen with oak worktop surfaces. We have a built-in dishwasher. We have a built-in fridge, space for the gas cooker and a little inset stainless steel sink unit with the swan net tap over. There is a little frosted window to the front, which you probably saw from that front footage but genuinely lovely, lovely room, really good size. We've got some really nice features here as well. So we've got the granite reveals, nice slate window seals. So remember this was an old Pilcher press. So the granite that you see here, they used to have the barrels underneath collecting the oil. Okay, so I'll take you through to the bathroom. It's been recently completed. Very, very nice luxury bathroom. We've got a stainless steel heated tower. Got these fabulous tiles on the floor. Good sized bath, again with a frosted or pattern window. It's a little sash window to the rear. We've got a mains connected shower. Wash and basement with drawers under a WC. Lovely illuminated bathroom mirror which I've been informed is also Bluetooth. So if you fancy sitting in a bath, listening to some music, you can connect your music, your phone up to the up to the mirror. Again, just another nice feature in here is that lovely old wood lintel above the above the window there. Right, we're now into bedroom two. We've got that nice ash floor throughout, radiator. Another sash window to the rear. Again, we've got those really nice character features, that lovely wood lintel, nice granite pillar. And again, the same granite that you see from the living area. Again, being that Pilcher's Press, we have those barrels underneath here. There's a nice bit of history with this, this property as well. Take me to bedroom one. Get another good size double. Again, with continuation of the ash floor. Nice granite reveals. There's a window to the side. That's all frosted, and that's the side where the garage is. We've got built-in wardrobes in here. Take a have a look. So we've got built-in wardrobes. Again, that lovely continuation of that nice big granite lid, uh, sorry, wood lint or above. Uh, very old steel pillar which was here when the original pilchard press was here so we now go into what is the garage the garage door is there it's been boarded there's another foot effectively from this wall to the to the garage door but this is effectively the garage we have a radiator in here. We have built-in wardrobes here with the boiler and the plumbing for washing machine and space for tumble dryer. 
So anybody coming in, I would say we'd need to probably convert this back into the garage again. Just knock that out and put the, the door back in there again. And that's where we are at the moment.